In a split second, Lacey Lewis's life changed forever. Her boyfriend, well-known Wichita motorcyclist Wayne Kemp, was killed after his bike hit an oil slick. Lacey was on the back of that motorcycle. She survived. Today, in her first television interview, Lacey spoke to KSN's Carly Willis about her grief and so many unanswered questions. Carly joins us now with her story. Carly. Jeff, Lacey told me about her time with Wayne and what it's been like since losing the love of her life. She also talked about the haunting circumstances surrounding the accident. It's been three months, and Lacey is still left with many unanswered questions. Returning to the scene of the crash that changed her life, Lacey Lewis struggles to contain a rush of emotion. It's been absolutely devastating, the worst three months of, of my life, honestly, um, especially not remembering the wreck. I, I think that makes it a little bit worse. I, I'm just waiting for him to walk through the door still. Life has taken a different tone for Lacey since losing what friends and family describe as a once in a lifetime kind of love with Wayne Kemp. We were together almost all the time and it still wasn't enough. Lacey herself is facing consultation with a brain surgeon after damage to her nerve seven in her brain, causing facial paralysis. After that, it's eye surgery and collarbone surgery. But none of that, she said, compares to the pain of losing Wayne. And he was just an honest, decent, a good man. Like they don't, they broke the mold when they made him. And because of just that, Wayne's known qualities of respect and humility, the Newton Toy Run, which now bears his name, is set to break records with more than a thousand motorcycles set to participate. I just love him so much and the fact that he can make this much of an impact even when he's not here is amazing. The family is still asking for anyone with information about that spill on the ramp in early August to call authorities. I wouldn't wish this nightmare on anybody, and I don't want it to happen to somebody else. The Kemp family is asking anyone who knows about the oil spill that caused Wayne to crash to please call Kansas Highway Patrol. For more information on the toy run this weekend in Wayne's honor, go to their Facebook page. It's called Newton Toy Run. Carly Willis, KSN News.